Welcome back. I haven't seen you guys in seems like forever. Um, I came here because I got some pretty cool things I wanted to show you guys. I got a couple pedals from a company called Maturo FX. They're in Miami, Florida. They're actually originally from Argentina, I believe, and uh, are now based out of Miami. So it's really cool. I mean, I lived in Florida for a lot of years. They have awesome little, have a little mascot guy there. Let's check this out. The inside's got all of the little things, all the little Maturo FX guys. And then inside, got like a little user's manual. Pretty sweet. Little description of the pedals there. <laughs> um, it also comes with a little sticker of the guy, which I already have on my wall over there. But all, all the fun, cutesy stuff aside, they make... A damn fine pedal so this is the reverb pedal this is the Maturo Golden Resortes reverb 60 this pedal is awesome I've been using it on a lower setting generally for um, for my gigs I'm out doing but it can get as reverby and ambient as you desire legitimately can give you whatever tones that you want a just true reverb to be it has it um, Personally, since I put it on my board, it has not come off. It has not even probably been turned off, to be honest. I use it constantly. So I'm going to show you a couple cool things you can do with that with acoustics as opposed to just doing like the traditional, uh, you know, demo that everyone does on where they just shred over, shred over it with their electric guitar for five minutes. And I'll also be showing you this. This is Maturo Chichio. Or it's like, I guess, cuchillo. It's, um, I believe, Spanish for knife, if I, if I remember correctly, if I remember my Spanish correctly. And uh, it's awesome. You see the blood coming down and everything. And as you remember, my last album, Blood Money, I'm just drenched in blood in that as well. So I saw this and I was like, this is an amazing pedal. It's actually got a great, I'm not like a big person. So the fact that it's a nice little foot size, it doesn't take up too much of the board. They both are, are really, really well constructed. A very pretty heavy duty, actually. And what's awesome about it, obviously, they're all 9 volt adaptable. This one has got the individual EQs. If you want to hit a mids, you want to do bass, treble. A lot of ones, even some of the distortion pedals I've loved in the past, will just usually have like a level, a gain, and then you're lucky if you have any sort of tone knob in the middle. This is, you've got obviously your gain, you've got your volume, mid, treble, and bass. What's neat about it is it's also bilingual. So it's all set up in English and in Spanish on each of the, the pedals, each of the knobs there, which I thought was actually pretty cool. Uh, same, with, same with these. This one's got cavern, onslaught, and swell, which would be expendor, caverna, and embate, I guess, or embate. I, I don't know how you say it, but... It's pretty cool. It's an awesome company. And make sure that you check them out. They've been here in America for a while now. And they're just getting their feet wet. They've been there um, making pedals for over 12 years. So, and uh, this is pretty cool. I'm just excited to, to have them here and actually to have some of their pedals on my board. So if you get a chance to check them out, please do. I will have all the... Um, you know, basically affiliate things in the bottom. I'll have all of their their uh, website, their links, everything, so you can follow them, check out all their new stuff, show them some love. They're very, very supportive and nice. And I mean, trust me, you're not gonna you're not gonna find a much better pedal from a much nicer people. So I'll tell you that right now. And once again, I do apologize for the long delay between videos. I'll be better about setting up my videos. I've just been on the road so much lately. But thank you. I am back. I want to give a shout out to the Pedal Garage guys because they are awesome too out there in England doing the Lord's work, showing us all the pedals that we wish we could have. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, but outside of that, thank you guys so much and um, enjoy the video. So what we're going to do today is I'm going to play a riff off my new album, Such Fickle Things. It's a song called The Hateful Nurturer, and I'm going to do it clean with just my um, standard little acoustic guitar here. 
and then I'm going to play it again using the Golden Resort Des Reverb. So you can kind of hear how it, it opens up the whole sound, kind of gives it a more professional, like, ambient feel. So, I'll let you hear it. <laughs> with pedal. So much warmer and bigger. It's awesome. Alright, so another really cool way to use your Golden Resortes Reverb Pedal by Matero FX is if you pair it with something else. Now I use mine in conjunction with a lot of different things on my rig that I use for acoustic shows. But what we do for electric shows or full shows is I will use it in conjunction, even in the studio, so that you can warm up and thicken up all of your tones. So instead of having just a clean individual, just like just, you know, one note lead type thing, it gives it that warmth and that soundscape that actually makes your sound so much warmer, so much bigger. And in conjunction with a distortion pedal or a overdrive pedal, it helps cut through the mix and on top of cutting through the mix, it still keeps its tonality and its warmth. So you're not just like sharp piercing through. So that being said, today I'm pairing mine with the Chichio by Matero FX, which is their distortion pedal. It is pretty awesome. It can give you all the way to thrash, from thrash all the way back to, you know, almost a transparent overdrive feel. Depends on how you want to EQ it. What's awesome is it does have individual EQ knobs. A lot of distortion pedals won't break it down into your, you know, each individual one. It's a pretty great pedal. Honestly, I've... I feel like I don't even give it enough justice, all the things I can I do, but it's an incredible pedal. What I'll do now is I'll, I'll play over a track that we were just recording, and you can actually hear it cut through the mix and do everything there. So. <laughs> Yeah, put, trying to throw so many notes in there. But, I mean, honestly. It's so fun to play that, that you almost don't want to, like, stop playing notes. Like, truthfully, I'll add <laughs> probably more notes than necessary on on any given track just due to the fact that it's that fun to just play around with. So on my new album, when you hear a bunch of extra things and you hear like all these awesome tones and things like that, it's because I'm probably having a lot of fun just like tracking down some cool stuff. So, so definitely check out the pedals. I'll have links below so you can follow them and see all the new stuff they're coming out with. And uh, thank you guys all so much for supporting me and everyone I've seen the past couple weeks. I know. I've been doing a lot of touring and traveling, so everyone who came out, thank you so much. Thank you, everyone who's been listening to the albums. Uh, yeah, it's just keep it going. I mean, we can only do what we can do, so, you know. Uh, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. Everybody knows